Hi, this is Neil Walters from Dallas, Texas, and I want to tell you about the three books I'm writing. The first two might surprise you. So first of all, if you think about the nicest book you have in your home, it's probably the Bible, right? Well, there's some really nice books you can buy, like, take a look at this one. I mean, it's actually very beautiful. I found this at Whole Foods, and notice it has the gilted pages, I think that's what they're called. Uh, beautiful binding, and what's really cool, it even has this little tiny latch or lock on it. And when you open it, it's basically a bunch of blank pages. So when I say I'm writing a book, well, this is not like a book I'm going to sell, this is a book I'm writing into. And so one of the courses I've been taking at Web Yeshiva is actually on Kabbalistic meditation. And one of the techniques he talked about was writing God's names in Hebrew. And there is a tradition in Judaism that when you write God's name on a piece of paper, you never throw that piece of paper away. So I thought, what would be more cool than buying this very beautiful special book and then using that to practice this type of meditation? And so I will keep this book on a special shelf, and I'll have it with me forever. So that's book number one. Book number two. This is also kind of a nice one. This is my iPass journal. And I'll have a link down below about what iPass is, but basically the, some of you have seen the videos of the conference that I went to in Florida recently. They're coming out with some new products and things. And uh, by the way, this book is also very nice. looks kind of like a little Bible, but it's basically, again, another open book where you can write whatever you want to in it. So I just started this practice this week. Actually, Jim Rohn has a, a course I want to listen to on how to journal. And this is not really a journal or a diary. This is going to be some of my business notes and my goals that, are going, that I want to read and reread daily. So I'm taking the best quotes that I've found, and I'm going to put those in here. And if I go to a seminar or something, I don't think I'm going to take notes in this book, but I think I'm going to take the best of my notes and then write them in this book. And then this book will be something I carry with me and treasure, and I'll review it, and I'll use it to get ideas when I need ideas for a business. And in the first maybe five or six pages of the book, I want to develop my goals and my statements, my plans for the upcoming year, and that kind of thing, and basically use it to keep me on track there. So again, check out the link below for the iPass book. And book number three, I don't have anything to show you, but that might be a real book, and that might be a New York Times bestseller. Uh, I want it to be a New York Times bestseller, but I actually won't even start writing that probably for two or three years. I'm working on the ideas in my head. Uh, a lot of conferences and other materials I've been to have talked about how to write books, how to make them New York Times bestsellers. I mean, there's a lot of work to make that happen, and I have to get all the different pieces in place. So I'm working on that, and you're just going to have to stay tuned, and I'll tell you about that one in a few years. So this is Neil Walters. Check the links below, and it's a pleasure talking to you as always.